Hi everyone, welcome to Provisual Tutorials. In this video, I'll show you how you can easily set up and showcase your design using ProVisual and 3D models. Let's navigate to the 3D Models section and select an object for our tutorial. The library contains a vast variety of high-quality 3D models and it gets updated weekly. In this tutorial, we will learn how to customize a 3D model of Juicebox. Let's find a 3D model. This open 200ml juice box will work great. Let's take a closer look at it. That's what we need. Let's create a new project. The model looks very laconic. Let's get started. First, let's change the main material of the box. Next, change the colors of the material to deep red. You can either select or customize the color using the color palette, or enter the color code manually, like this, fine. Next, let's customize the material of the box a little. Now let's zoom in the model in order to more accurately change the color of the edge's carton material. The default foil material looks so real. Let's leave it as it is. Now let's paint the straw element in a brighter color. Great. The next step is to go to the environment settings. Here we will adjust the light a little horizontally and vertically. Let's make the object more voluminous with beautiful highlights on the edges of the box. Excellent lighting for our 3D model. Now let's add some design to our juice box model. To add the design, you can click on the Add Design button on the Design Layers panel. You can also download a UV map and create your design in another editor. I've already prepared some images for our juice box. Let's add the first design element. In the opened window, we see the editor where we can move and modify our design. Here in the left window, the position of our design on the 3D model is displayed in real time. Let's reset the coordinates of the position of our design. Great. Save the design. Now, let's add a text block to our design. Click on the Add Design button on the Design Layers panel. Excellent. Save the design. The next step is to add more personality to our design. First, let's change the material of our text, and then we'll change the material settings to make the design look more realistic. Our text on the box is now more glossy. Next, copy the settings of our design and apply them to another design layer. Great. Now let's add dimension to our design using bevel. looks amazing. The next step is to place the background behind our 3D model. Let's see what types of pre-made backgrounds we have available. We can choose a solid fill as the background, or we can go for a gradient fill. Here, we can select the desired colors and also set the direction of the fill, linear or radial. You can also pick one of the pre-designed backgrounds that we've prepared for you. Or, add your own image, let's add one. Excellent! You can turn on moving lights to see how the light can enhance the shape and texture of the 3D model. 
You can also rotate the 3D model to see how the design looks in motion. Saving project. After you've completed your design, you can share it by clicking the share button. You'll get a shareable link to open the interactive viewer with your 3D model. Share it with colleagues, friends, or clients. And that's the end of our tutorial on creating opened 200 ml juice box with straw design. We hope this has been helpful for you. See you in the upcoming tutorials.